you know, this time of the year, it's always better to get on the warm side of those cold snaps. Right now, we're looking forward to some wonderful weather. Today was really nice outside. Sunny skies. Once we got some of that smoke out of the area, it was nice to be outside this afternoon. Temperatures warming into the mid 60s today. This after morning lows at or below freezing across the Ozarks. I was telling you last night that it was going to be a night where there was going to be some variability. Generally, lows are in the low 30s. But those typically more cold prone locations got even colder, dipping into the upper 20s out of the airport. Uh, 27 in Rolla, 29 this morning in Fort Leonard Wood. So it was cold, it was frosty, but things are, are looking up temperature wise. We managed to get into the 60s today. In fact, temperatures today a little bit above normal. So again, we're now on the warm side of that cold snap. They got going earlier this week and continued through this morning and we've got uh, warmer weather to look forward to. We uh, have got that area high pressure that delivered the cold a few days ago now down to our south. So now it's delivering warm air to the area on southwest winds and there's a big reservoir of warm air to our west. It's going to get pushed across the Ozarks through Friday. So look for temperatures tomorrow to be about 10 degrees warmer than they were today. Now those winds are going to be picking up. In fact, they're going to get very gusty, especially as we get into maybe 11 a.m. into the afternoon hours. At that point, much of the area is likely going to have gusts in the 25 to 35 mile per hour range. I think here in Springfield, we could have gusts approaching 40 miles per hour, but west of Highway 65, gusts between 40 and 50 miles per hour will be a possibility. And a wind advisory has been put in place that runs from 10 a.m. through 7 p.m. In addition to the wind, which is an issue if you're driving, especially it's an issue if you're burning any brush, uh, you know, fires can really quickly get out of hand, especially given that the air is going to be very dry in the afternoon. So if you can not do any brush burning tomorrow, especially where we have this wind advisory, don't do it. Uh, looking at our forecast for tonight, it stays clear. It stays quiet, not as cold. Thanks to the winds picking up. And then looking ahead to tomorrow, we're going to find a fairly sunny morning giving way to a bit more of a high overcast during the afternoon, but that shouldn't slow temperatures down too much. About 44 for morning low with an afternoon high of about 73 here in Springfield. Generally speaking, it looks like low to mid 70s across the area. This weekend still looks like we're going to have this front draped over the region. Uh, looks like for the most part, it's going to wobble around here across central and northern Missouri. Uh, and north of that front, I mean, this is key to the forecast this weekend, really key to the temperatures north of that frontal boundary. It's generally going to be between 60 and 70 for highs, while south of that front, it'll be between 70 and 80 degrees for highs. Another forecast factor, especially on Saturday, is cloud cover. A lot of the model guidance has been indicating that, hey, it's going to be very cloudy on Saturday. And if that's the case, the temperatures are going to be cooler. We start off mild in the low to mid 50s. If we have a lot of cloud cover, highs on Saturday will be colder than what I'm forecasting. It would be more like low 70s. But the way I think this is going to go down, I think we are going to find more cloud cover closer to central Missouri. But I think further south, the clouds are going to tend to thin out and we'll find partly sunny skies. And that opens the door for highs in the mid to upper 70s with highs in the low to mid 70s closer to central Missouri. And then Saturday night, temperatures only drop into the upper 50s. And with a warm start, well, we're going to be looking at a warm day on Easter Sunday. We'll be up to 72 by noon with an afternoon high of about 78 degrees. And there will be some spots that could hit 80. Uh, winds will pick up, though, out of the southwest once again. This ahead of a storm that will be moving in from the west. And that storm will likely generate a risk of severe weather from Texas through the Ozarks into Illinois Monday afternoon into Monday night. So I'm going with a weather aware day for that reason. And then my my take on the setup is that we're going to see similar weather to what we had a few Thursdays ago when we had that round of severe weather move across the Ozarks, especially with wind. Uh, beyond Monday, it turns colder again. It looks like it may be a struggle to get out of the 40s on Tuesday with showers and clouds. Wednesday, we may be down near freezing that morning for a low with afternoon highs in the upper 50s, but we should be back in the mid 60s by Thursday. Yeah, it looks like a nice rebound next mm -hmm. Thursday. Yeah. All right, Jamie. Roughly 30% of Missouri school